Oh, maybe she's dying. Honestly, anything could happen in a show. She's totally dying. It's been about two weeks since I recorded the first episode. And this is how it's going to work. You're going to get two episodes in a single video over the course of two, two weeks, okay? This is just how it's going to work because I'm not able to get up and be excited for Vinland Saga. I have to wake up and want to be in despair that I can't watch Vinland Saga right away because I have college. Moving forward, the start of episode one was just insane. We met Thorfinn at the end and we got introduced to a new main character, kind of? But I don't know. I'm happy we got Thorfinn. I was kind of getting worried that we, we weren't going to get Thorfinn. Um, but this, this, this season looking like it's about to be a bit deeper. The, the opening and the ending kind of hinting at, at some deeper, deeper emotional stirrings going on in Thorfinn's character. And I'm, I'm, I'm here for it. I don't care if there's not that much violence anymore in the, the season. Vinland Saga is just that. It's just amazing storytelling. And now sh play the fucking motorcycle. Oh my god. Do you understand how much I miss this fucking motorcycle, bro? <gasps> oh, and it's my papa now! Oh, shit! Risto! <laughs> already, already, opening with a hard word. Damn. Is this... This is in Japanese. Oh my god, no, no, no. I just saw a horse's foot, bro. Dude, does this mean I have a foot fetish? My mind went bonkers over this! What is this?! Carve it into- oh. The OST as well. The humming in the back. What the fuck?! This isn't an anime. This this isn't a fucking anime. Animes aren't supposed to be like this. And I am so happy an anime isn't is like this. Who is this lad, bro? Bro's bro's hype. You had to ruin my guy's moment. You had to ruin it. My guy was, my guy was stoked. He, he put it, he put in like, like a few inches into that tree. Not chill, chill, chill out. Not like that. Pause. He dented the tree. All right. And my guy's moment was ruined by some delinquent throwing some kunai at him. Why are you attacking that tree? I don't know. Isn't he a lumberjack? Oh, that's why. That's why. He's he's getting ready to decapitate someone's head off. Personally. Personally, I start training on her. Honestly. Oh, dude. It's so beautiful. The OST. It's so beautiful already. The food. Oh, my lord. I just need to pray real quick, bro. I just need to thank the Lord for letting me be alive to witness this, this type of... This, this type of animation and... and story unfold right before my eyes starting from episode one you know season one i i i had all the episodes i could have binged it now now it's unfolding unraveling in front of my eyes i'm gonna have some heartbreaks with these these cliffhangers i i can't binge it it's gonna be struggle watching week to week but i'm so glad i'm doing it oh my god it's so pretty it's so beautiful Dude, you have a great family. Let me tell you. Let me fucking tell you. That's an amazing family. Too beautiful lady. I honestly wouldn't go that far considering you're... I'm assuming you're his family. So let's... Step it back a bit, okay? I won't make it weird, but... Kind of came off as weird. Dude, it's... What is this OST? What did they drug the musicians with this time? Oh my god. This is this is like some Terraria Starbound soundtrack right here. Oh. 
Oh my god. Yeah, okay, what a switch. We went from this. Ugh. Uh, ah! Murder! Kill! Fire! No, 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 no. How do you- how do you swap from this? Oh my god, I love it as well, bro. I don't fucking care. Death, destruction, beautiful, like, sunset. Oh my- I, I don't care. It's all beautiful. It's all amazing. She's freaking out. She's- she's losing it. But your, your ma's there. Don't worry, your ma's there for now, okay? I know how this goes. She's so dying. Or maybe she's dying. Honestly, anything could happen in a show. She's totally dying. I knew it. She's dead. She's dead first. She's done. She's gone. I fucking knew it. Ooh. Oh, no. She's next too. I don't even know who these characters are. And I'm, I feel bad. It was set up so beautifully. Oh, yeah. She dead. I'm sorry, but but she dead. This is also called Vinland Saga. This is this isn't like One Piece where they all live. She she dead. So where, where's the other arrow? Did did the guy just shoot one arrow and was like, I'll I'll let them like you know despair in pain. Oh no, that no. Ew, don't say that. Oh, I forgot this. This anime is sick. It's sick in the head and it's real. She's ah, uh, and she she's even laughing in this moment. Ah, bro. Flip of the switch. That's all it was. Flip of the switch. Immediately beautiful, and then it's this is Vinland Saga. This is what we're here for. This is what we're in for. We can't expect anything. Oh, he... Oh, he's gonna... Bro, use your goddamn axe! Oh, no way. No, 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 dude. I feel... No, no, he's in too much shock. Ooh! Oh shit, now she's gonna- No, no, she's- No, she's- No, 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 no! Not even halfway- Not even halfway through the episode, and God said, CHARACTER DEVELOPMENT! Nobody knows who you are, but CHARACTER DEVELOPMENT! This is how we start in season two off, and they still- Putting copious amounts of opioids into the musicians in this moment. If this guy doesn't pop off, bro. This guy better pop off. Because either he's going to pop off in this moment. Or that hate's going to build. We have Thorfinn 2.0. Oh my god. What is this guy? Hit 100%? Holy. Oh, what is this? The screams. That animation, the depiction! A fur on a barren land withers with neither bark nor leaves. So too does the man loved by none. Why should he live a long life? Havabal. Dude, the lore. The lore that they're adding in this shit. I love it. I love it already. Oh my god. Dude, and we back we more back to more despair. Human trafficking. This is where we're at already. Oh shit. Oh, she's dying. Like, I don't know who coughs like that on the ground. Like, looks like they suffocating. And you know, thinks they live in. They making it through it. Nah. Bro, she looked like a Titan. I can't lie. This mop of animator style, they bring in the Titan in these people. Overboard? Is that how it goes? That's, that is messed up. That is messed up. He, he, he definitely needed to happen, buddy guy. It's a tough world. It ain't all sunshines and rainbows. 
<laughs> Don't be sick. You heard him. See, I, I said Thorfinn two point oh, but he's kind of, he's not going for revenge. None of that. He's just, he's trying to make it by and continue for his family. It's like a good parallel, and we know for sure Thorfinn and. This Einar dude is gonna meet up because we saw in the trailer. They both have similar backstories, but they're two different personalities that are gonna collide. They just going all out with the OST. I swear, they going insane with the OST, and he ran. He ran. He got out of there. Oh, he booking it. Ain't no way. He's he, just like that. What shitty fucking guards? What the hell? I mean, like, I'm fucking happy, bro. He booked it out of there. He made it alive. But damn. Now he's r ramsacking a house. A poor little house, bro. That's so unfortunate. Oh, and he got found, bro. That's so unfortunate. Uh, he got beat to a fucking pulp, bro. Oh, shit. Guy's gonna make a comeback story. He's gonna make a whole comeback story. Ain't gonna be no revenge story. They still going at it on him. Oh, you're enjoying this a bit too much. That fucking hurts. I feel that. I feel that. Bro! My guy's cute as fuck! Don't diss him! Bro, look at that guy! He's a sexy ass man! Chiseled ass body, bro. The body makes the face in the end. At the end of the day, like fuck you. Look at this guy. You can already tell he's growing. He's trying to get that Thorfinn hair going. No fist. Oh, I was I was ready for like you know he's gonna get pissed, but I guess not. He's not that type of character. No, now he's breaking. He's breaking now. Joe's face. My boy, bail him out. Bail him out. I forgot your name, but bail him out. Is that it? Don't tell me that's it. Oh, no, it's not it. Yes. More. More Midland Saga. That's what we're talking about. Oh my lord. So are we a bit set back? Or after Askeladd died? Is he gonna set him free at least? Oh. I feel bad if he... Oh man. He could have bailed him out. And he would have lived, lived an amazing life. Became practically brothers with Thorfinn. Too bad Thorfinn does not have a care in the world at the moment. That's a really weird thing to ask, but... Doing a hell of a lot of grunting and not a lot of talking. Usually I'm supposed to hear inside of your head. Look at everybody. No eyes except the main characters, bro. You know who the main characters are when they have eyes. Oh my fucking god, it's majestic. It's... Is this heaven? Is this Valhalla? Oh my god, he's seeing his family! Is it- is- is this- or is this real wheat? Have they- have they just started going into the field and- and- and videotaping real wheat? What the- Bro, we broke a new ground. CGI wheat! Oh, this guy's character. It's such a flip compared to Thorfinn's. And I am so ready to see the contrast between them when they when they meet. And they're gonna end it there. They ain't gonna they gonna they're gonna end it there. Listen to the OST! Oh shit! No way! 
So this was after Oscalod died. Our boy! That majestic flow! Dude, dude. You guys about to be like the bestest of like friends. Best friends, brothers, bro. Look at this guy! Oh my god, the OST making it sound like a fucking kaiju is about to come out of the ocean. <sighs> there, there it is. This, this is what I look forward every goddamn Monday and I can't do that. I can't, I can't do that. Fuck. Having life is fucking annoying. God, bro. Back to this fucking beautiful golden field, man. Oh, the visual, bro. You can tell the visuals have upgraded an incredible amount. There's, there's this light feel to it now. It's so, oh my god, and Thorfinn, Thorfinn! It's a farm. It's exactly what it is. Oh, n never mind, a forest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, wait, I'm wrong? This is a future wheat farm. Bro, bro, you just bought him? And now, now you're gonna be buying from him? The person you just bought? Oh, what a W guy, low key. He's not even an owner anymore. Like, they're practically free. Oh, shit. Did people like this exist before? Did this guy has a better mindset than some of the people in today's age. And it's 2023. 2023, and this guy's probably better than, like, he's better than me. He's a better person than me. What the fuck? <laughs> Bro, he's shocked. He's fucking bewildered. You can't, you can't buy someone, tell them to work, and then tell them that they can buy themselves back so they'll be free. Bro, anybody would be bamboozled from that. Oh, this is crazy. What? <laughs> Bro, Thorfinn's just going, man. Thorfinn looking mad depressed, though. Thorfinn had a slave, kind of. Kind of just died in his house the moment he found him. Dude, nobody knows Iceland. Yeah, <laughs> nobody knows Iceland. It's such like a remote area and where Thor wanted to hide. Literally an entire forest. Bro, he, I don't think he understands the magnitude of, of everything there. Dude, let it click. Come on, click, bro. You understand the magnitude of this project. That's even ridiculous. They're, 100, they're not even showing everything in the frame. That's how fucking big it is. They only got that little fucking vagina cut out already? They got the pubes lined out and everything. This is... What's, what, what the fuck? Oh shit! I thought that was back in my old neighborhood. Fucking gunshots everywhere. It's just Thorfinn being an absolute chad, channeling his inner Thorkel to cut down some some trees. You know. Hey, wait, wait, wait. What <laughs> was he working on this? Like, like at the start of the first episode, he was he was training his craft, even though it's training to kill. But he was hitting trees. Same thing. W foreshadowing. W foreshadowing. Is that what they say? He's saying you smell. <laughs> the way Thorfinn just threw that damn axe in there. He's gonna pull the branch off with his fucking muscles. They live in good as slaves. I can't even lie. Yo, I don't I don't trust it. I wouldn't trust it. Thorfinn's like, this guy's a fucking pain in the ass. <laughs> what is he? Oh, so these guys are the dickheads. Okay. Dude, he ate all of it. I bet that shit was full. Bro, what did you expect? Thorfinn's gonna shut him up and just take the fucking food. Or just snag the food and eat it for himself. That, that can work too. This guy gotta learn the hard way. He realizes he's still a slave. Nah, bro. If he... Bro, you're a slave. Chill out. Okay, never mind. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. Beat him to a pulp. Thorfinn, hop in on this shit. I know what you can do. I know what you can do.
Oh, Thorfinn's changed. Thorfinn's changed. Bro. Past Thorfinn would ask for a reward, bro. My guy would be like, if I bring you this head, will you, will you, will you show me some respect? Like, that, that, that's how it works. He'd be asking for, he'd be asking to bring, like, multiple heads and, and slicing up armies just, just to, to earn some respect in a, a duel. D this is, what happened to Thorfinn? My boy. I, I knew this, I knew this is the direction that they're going for, but damn. You gotta be the dumbest motherfucker on the planet, bro. You understand you just called yourself a slave and you got like, you don't need to be so obedient. Yes, you do. You, you don't, you die. I mean, I know Thorfinn can handle himself, but you know. <laughs> I, ho I, ho I don't know if you understand Thorfinn's strength here. Like the horse, the horse is going to be doing like 30% of the work. And, and Thorfinn? Th Thorfinn just, the Thorfinn hauls ass, bro. Thorfinn got that dog in him. Literally. Thorfinn got, look, he's literally pushing over the, the horse. Yo, you wanna, you wanna roll the log a bit. Thorfinn's voice actor sounded a bit different. I liked it though. I mean, he did get older, but. Damn! Aider got that dog in him as well! I didn't know I'd be, I'd be hyping up these motherfuckers to push a log, bro. Hype. Hype. I, be, I bet I bet Thorfinn picked that shit up like Thorkel at one point and threw it into the fucking river. Hey yo, just just look into the future, you know? You'll get there at one point. This is like seeing both of their roles reversed in a way. It's kind of interesting. Like you see you see Einar is pissed at everything. And that's what that's what Thorfinn was in season one. Bro was mad at everything. This it's kind of different because this guy's fucking weak, you know. He 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 can't he can't slice down an army. He can't he he can't do multiple backflips and cut people's head offs in the process of of doing them them fantastic gymnastic skills. But he still has the same demeanor of of not wanting to to suffice for something like that. Thorfinn, Thorfinn's sad. Thorfinn doesn't give a shit anymore. Thorfinn's lost. After seeing Askeladd get killed in front of him, his goal, his his vengeance, get get taken away from him, he's got nothing. He's lost. He doesn't know what to do. And then Einar is coming in, kind of reciprocating how he felt before, and it's 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 interesting. Dude, this is the most emotion that Thorfinn's experienced in a while. Dude. Oh shit, buddy guy got a crush already. That's <laughs> damn, damn. Bro, love at first sight. Love at first sight. There it is. There it is. He don't give a fuck about anything anymore. That's his goal. That's his goddamn goal. Love, love. And his music's majestic, bro. I might start falling in love. I don't know with what. The fucking sunset. The horse. Oh, this is beautiful, bro. Oh, this is majestic, man. Dude, we love, we love when everybody doesn't have fucking eyes. We waited so long for nobody to have pupils, bro. Eyes. Like, like balls in their sockets, man. Bro, he got distracted by love. His, his heart turned, his eyes turned into hearts. That's where they went, actually. It just dissipated in the sky. Like hearts. Floating hearts. That's beautiful. That's amazing. I love that. Damn. That's a lot of wheat. Bro, even he's working. Bro's like the white beard of Vinland Saga. My guy's just making a whole family of slaves and shit. Picking up people from the sticks. Bro, I love this OST too, man. Damn. I love the- I, lo I don't know. I'm so distracted by the instrumentals. I love these. If you're gonna lead others. Is he like his son and he's gonna be the successor or some s something? If so, I have a bad feeling Mr. Master is gonna die and that guy's gonna take over and shit's gonna go south.
Bro, bro, bro can't even lift it. <laughs> oh my god, he's all bark, no bite. Of course, he looks like that, bro. God. Yeah. Yeah, you, you slide that shit back into the sheath. Oh, yeah, no. He, he ain't going anywhere if he can't even pull his sword out of his sheath. Oh, my guy was getting it on. My guy was doing the dirty in front of the moth. <laughs> you made me think for a second. I, nah, nah, nah. You don't even understand. Damn. At least you got someone who cares about you. Damn, she a dog too. Sheesh. Oh. Oh, the, the old man's pulling strings. Okay. You you sick fuck. I mean, I understand. You're slaves. You gotta do what you gotta do, but... Come on. That's kind of kind of scummy using your daughter as a sex toy, bro. Ah, yo, don't go like that. Don't... No, not you too. He isn't as dumb as he looks, apparently. Who'd have thought? Who would have thought? <laughs> No way he runs away, bro. <laughs> Bro's like Team Rocket blasting off again. <laughs> you guys are what to talk. Y'all y'all both drunk in the middle of a fucking wheat field at night. That's basically that's basically the step towards a cornfield at night. You don't wanna fuck with that. They're they're shining a big spotlight on this character. I'm curious what type of role he's gonna play down the line. Because Seems like a scumbag, but I could see how he might change into a better person. I'm not sure. Maybe I'm giving too much hope to him because I, I kind of really fucking hate him. Like it's, I just want to kick him in the balls and some shit. But you were just like him. He was literally... He's saying this because he knows now. And then it's crazy because Thorfinn knows exactly what he's saying. This is crazy. The overlapping characters. Dude, the storytelling. The OST. The emotion. This was way before his second village got burned down to when he was young. Oh, and Thorfinn knows. Oh, Thorfinn knows about the Danes. He knows all about this. Dude, respect to him for just holding on like this too, though. He has these deep scars in his memories. And he isn't going berserk, nor is he giving up. And Thorfinn's gone berserk. And he's giving up now. It looks like it. Oh my god! That's the village he's... Thorfinn was there. I had a sneaky lingering thinking that Thorfinn might have been the one that that also pillaged his village. But to think that th that was the first village that Thorfinn witnessed Askeladd's crew pillage is insane. When he was young, when he didn't even know anything, when he was he was clouded through fear. This fucking show never ceases to amaze me, bro. The show is amazing. Holy shit, man. I, I usually just end the videos and, and don't talk because you guys don't fucking watch this part. You guys just click off at this moment. But this is a show where I gotta talk. I, I gotta give my analysis. It's, it's that type of show. I can't just go fucking scream bonkers and, and go crazy and, and that's it. Give you hype, give you energy. No, it's deep. It's deep, and you can tell from there the, the 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 differences in the characters, how they overlap, the parallels that what they once were. It's hard. It hits. It hits hard. And oh my god, it's only to, Vinland Saga is, is only gonna get get better and better. There's 24 episodes of this season. 24 fucking episodes. I can't wait. I can't. I can't wait, bro.